Hello everyone. Now we will start with a new topic as a part of a PAP Oops. And our new topic is casting. What is casting in a PAP Oops? We already listened the term type casting. We did the type casting so many times. What we did in the type casting? We assigned one type of variable to another type of variable. Now in ABAP, oops, casting is just same, but we will talk in terms of instances. So what is casting in ABAP, oops? Assigning the instance of parent class to child class, or we can go for vice versa also. Assigning the instance of child class to parent class is called as casting. So what is casting in a BAP? Oops. Assigning the, pay, assigning the instance of parent class or super class to the instance of child class or subclass or we can go for vice versa also. Assigning the instance of subclass or child class to the instance of parent class or super class is called as casting. Now in SAP ABAP OOPS, we have two types of casting. One is narrow casting and one is wide casting. One is your narrow and another is the wide casting. Narrow casting is also called as up casting and wide casting is also called as down casting. During the interview, people always confuse between the terms. So once I will proceed, just keep in mind that diagram. Once you keep in mind that diagram, you will never, never confuse between the terms why narrow is called as up and why wide is called as down. So we'll start with our first type of casting. What is narrow casting? Narrow casting is also, also called as up casting. So what is narrow casting? In narrow casting, we assign the instance of child class to the parent class or we can say we assign the instance of subclass to the super class in narrow casting the subclass instance is assigned to the instance of super class or parent class now you will automatically understand why it is called as narrow casting. As we are moving from more specific view to less specific view, so it is called as narrow casting. Just see, we are assigning from child to parent. So you can see we have this is one view. This is one view. Now from more specific view, so we are going to less specific view. Or you can think in that way also. We have more wider. We have more width. Now we have less width. So we are going in a narrow direction. We are going in narrowing. So that's why it is called as narrow casting. We are moving from more specific view. We have this child view, we have this child view, we have this child view. Now we are moving on to parent or we can go understand in that way also. We have more width. Now the width is getting decreased. We are going in narrowing. So that's why it is called as narrow casting. Now you can understand also very clearly why, why it is called as up casting. Because the path is going from subclass to the superclass. It is going in the upward direction. So it is called as upcasting. So just keep this diagram in mind. You, once you have the diagram and definition is clear, 
you will never never confuse why it is called as narrow and why it is called as up casting now whenever we will go for narrow casting the operator which we will use is assignment operator you all know what is assignment operator equal to so in case of narrow casting we will use the assignment operator means we will use equal to suppose if i will go for the example suppose allo underscore child is the instance of child class or subclass allo underscore super is the instance of parent class or super class then how how we will go for narrow casting we will assign the instance of child class to the super class by which particular operator assignment operator simple whenever we will do the practical i will show you so in case of narrow casting we will use the assignment operator and how we will assign the instance of child class to the super class by simply using equal to now we will move on to our next type of casting what is our next type of casting it is wide casting wide casting is also called as a down casting just keep this diagram in mind and you will automatically understand in wide casting we will assign the instance of parent class to the child class or we can understand we will assign the instance of super class to the sub classes now why why it is called as wide casting just see previously we have this view now we have this view this view this view so previously we have this much width now the width is increasing so from narrow we are going in a wide or we can understand in a way also we are moving from less specific view to the more specific view you can see previously we have this much width now we have this much width because from the parent we are going to the child we are assigning the purpose we are assigning the instance of super class to the child class now you can understand why why it is called as down casting because the path is going from super class to sub class in the down direction so that's why it is called as down casting now this point is extremely important and in every interview when whenever interview will ask what is casting they will simply simply ask what is the operator used for wide casting or down casting see in narrow casting we use the assignment operator equal to we use the assignment operator now whenever we will go for wide casting we will use the conversion operator and question mark and equal to is called as conversion operator any interviewer will ask what is the operator used for narrow casting what is the operator used for wide casting in case of narrow casting the operator is assignment equal to in case of wide casting the operator is conversion it is question mark equal to now what we are doing in wide casting we are assigning the instance of parent class to the child class now this allo underscore super is the instance of parent class how we can assign it to child class by using the conversion operator question mark and equal to just keep this diagram in mind and everything will be automatically cleared so what is the summary of this particular video in this video we started with the topic casting in terms of a pap oops what is casting assigning but the generic meaning of casting is what assigning one to another this is the generic meaning of casting in terms of a back oops what is the meaning of casting 
assigning the instance of parent to child or child to parent is called as casting or assigning the instance of superclass to subclass or subclass to superclass is called as your casting. We have two types of casting, narrow casting, wide casting. Narrow casting is called as your up casting and wide casting is called as your down casting. Now, what is narrow casting? Just remember that definition. Assigning the instance of child class to parent class is called as narrow casting. Now, you will automatically understand why it is narrow. Because previously, you have more specific view. Now, you are going in a up direction. You are going in a less specific view. Or you can understand. Previously, you have this much bit. Now your width is decreasing, you are narrowing. So that's, that's why it is called as narrow casting. And why it is called as up casting? Because we are going, the path is going from subclass to the parent class, or we can say subclass to the super class. So that's why it is called as up casting. Now, Whenever we will go for narrow casting or up casting, but the operator we will use assignment operator equal to. So we took the example. This is our instance of the child class. This is our instance of the parent class or super class. So we simply, simply assigned the, as the instance of child class to super class. How? by simply using equal to, do not confuse by the term, child is called as sub, parent is called as super. Now, after that we covered wide casting. Now, in case of wide casting, we will assign the instance of parent class to the child class. You can easily understand why it is called as wide casting, because we are moving from less specific view to the more specific view. Now the width is increasing. And why it is called as a down casting? Because we are, the path is from parent class to child class in the downward direction. Now the most important point is whenever you will go for wide casting or down casting, you cannot use assignment operator. You need to use conversion operator. What is conversion operator? Question mark and equal to. So if this is the object of our super class and this is the object of our child class, how, how we will go for wide casting? We will simply, simply use the conversion operator question mark and equal to. In the next video, Whenever we will start with the practical part, you will understand what is the benefit, why we are going for upcasting, why we are going for downcasting, why this concept is there. So whenever we will start with the practical part, you will understand how useful this particular concept is. So that's it in this video. Thank you.